What do you think? Uh, yeah, it's unbelievable. Erminio Bugliani has waited 25 years for this moment. In 1983, he lost his left hand while playing with fireworks near his home in Pennsylvania. And they told me shortly after my accident that uh, we're going to give you an operation here. We're going to be able to say, you know, save all your nerve function. At that time, artificial limbs were wooden replicas or hooks with limited functions. But his doctors knew that a bionic hand might be possible. Today it is a reality, and Erminio Bugliani's long wait is over. You know, it almost felt like it was a part of me. And that's the truth. Erminio is getting fitted with a new prosthetic hand called the eye limb. Sensors embedded in the arm read electrical impulses from the brain to open or close the hand. Then a microprocessor in the palm of the hand controls the individual motors in each finger to determine the force needed to hold different objects. There you go. Prosthetist Jared Howell says Erminio's ability to operate the hand on his first day exceeds expectations. To have him actually put the hand on and be able to manipulate objects, um, close and open the hand, you know, control the thumb, control the fingers, all of that in the very first day, to the extent that he was able to do it, I was, I was impressed. Touch Bionics, the Scottish company that makes the hand, says more than 400 amputees are now using the eye limb, which can cost between 50 and $70,000. It is a lot of money, but the dexterity it offers is unlike any previous prosthetic device. It's unreal. Upon seeing Erminio with a working hand, his sister, Lisa Murphy, cried. He's not going to be looked at as the man without a hand. He'll actually be able to walk into a, a store and be just like a normal person. See, now all of a sudden you've got a pointer finger. But Erminio was less emotional. I wouldn't say there's going to be any tears from this direction. If anything, there's going to be some... Uh, hoots and hollering and, 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 and joyous in that regard. Can you hold my hand? Instead of celebrating, Erminio Bugliani is too focused on his new hand and the possibilities that lie ahead. Brian Patton, VOA News.